Alice is a system for controlling a cold atom experiment in Aarhus, Denmark. It allows players, like you, to access real atoms in our laboratory. The experiment itself looks like this. A cold cloud of atoms is pre-cooled in the first chamber and transported to the second chamber with the help of magnetic fields. In the second chamber, the final cooling happens with a magnetic field and two laser beams. This is the part our players control online. Players have a tool for modifying three curves that determine how the magnetic field and the lasers are turned on and off. After submitting their solution, Alice scans the curves and switches the magnets and lasers on and off accordingly. That's how you can directly control real atoms in a quantum experiment. So let's dive a bit deeper into how the atoms are actually cooled down. After the pre-cooling, the atom cloud is like hot coffee in a coffee cup that's made of a magnetic field. To cool the atoms further, they are transferred to a new cup made by the two lasers. Because our coffee cups are made of magnetic fields and laser fields, we can't simply pour the atomic coffee from one cup to another. Instead, we move the atoms from one cup to another by making the magnetic cup disappear. This is done by turning off the magnetic field. When the atoms are in the laser cup, we let the hottest atoms escape by lowering the cup's brim. This is done by turning down the power of the two lasers. Doing this carefully, all the hot atoms escape, leaving only ultra-cold atoms in the trap. So to recall, we transfer hot atomic coffee from one cup to another and cool it down by evaporating. This is the only way of solving the problem, and we know that better solutions are out there, but we don't know what they are. That's why we need your help. In the Alice Challenge, you can improve our solution or make up your own. Figure out which sequence of magnets and lasers trap the most cold atoms and create real scientific results. Thanks for playing.